Hi, I'm Danny and these are my diecast disasters. In this video we've got a proper diecast disaster of a car. It's a Matchbox Nissan 300ZX. This version was produced from 1986 until 1988 and they produced another version from 1990 until 1998 was a slightly later model and it had a sunroof on it and this version has the opening bonnet so we'll take our example here off the turntable and have a closer look at it it's had a right squashing on the roof there totally caved in the windscreen's been really badly damaged these are a two-part metal car that whole lower section is all metal there it's kind of a hole been jabbed through the rear windscreen and the interior there god knows what happened to this car i'll first take it apart there's three posts holding this one together i couldn't really put it in my vice properly because it's got those side mirrors that stick right out You can see something's gone right through the windscreen and the interior there. They're reasonably tough, it's take quite a bit of force to do that. The base is painted on this one, so I'm gonna have to strip that as well. So I'll pop these wheels and axles out of there. I'm not going to be using those anyway. And then I strip the parts with some poly stripper. So here's our beaten up car body. See that back pillar's totally smashed there. I actually think this is going to be a really cool casting to do a crash scene out of, or maybe a junkyard sort of scene. So rather than spend all day trying to repair it, I've got a replacement body here. Next I give all of the castings a good going over with the wire brush and my rotary tool. Get rid of the oxidation and any scraps of paint that are remaining on them. There we go, they're looking a lot shinier and cleaner. and ready to have some paint on them. I'll start out with some black primer on all of the parts. Next they were painted with Vallejo Metal Color Magnesium and then painted very lightly over the top with Vallejo Metal Color Silver. The base and the hood were left with this silver color and I painted the body of the car with four coats of Vallejo Racing Candy Blue. Next I paint in the details on the body of the car. I'll start with the roof here. Also painted the door handles and the interior of the engine bay in this black. Next I detail the lights and the indicators in chrome. I 
I detail the engine bay. I start out by painting it steel and then I paint in some finer details. I use Tamiya Clear Orange for the indicators. And finally, to me, a clear red for the tail lights. And this was all finished with a couple of coats of nice gloss varnish. Moving on to the interior here. That hole that's been jabbed right through it. Again, I could fix this up, but I'll just keep it for my crash scene one. And I've got this replacement here from the donor car. So I'll detail it a little bit. I just start by painting it black. There wasn't a lot of detail in the interiors of these cars. And then I paint the middle of the seats in gray. Here's the base and the bonnet or hood, depending on where you're from. And these have just had a couple of coats of gloss as well. The windscreen here. There's going to be no saving and retro riding this one. It's like a dog's chewed it. So I've got my replacement one here. It's in pretty good condition, just a little bit scuffed. So I'll give it a quick polish. And then it's given a dip in some self-shining floor polish and left to dry. And finally the wheels, they are hideous. So I'll be replacing those with some aftermarket ones. And so here we go, here are all the parts of our Nissan 300ZX refurbished, repainted and ready to go back together. I can't lie, it's only about half of the original car there, but sometimes that's just what you've got to do. Before we take a look at the reassembled car, let's just take a moment to look back and be reminded of what we started with. A proper die-cast disaster of a little matchbox Nissan. I don't know if it's been trodden on or driven over with a bicycle or something. Anyway, it's in pretty terrible condition, but they're such a cool little car, it's definitely worth giving it a second chance. And here it is, our finished, restored and customised Matchbox Nissan 300ZX. 
the caved in roof and chewed up windscreen are gone replaced with nice new ones and it's been given a cool new two-tone candy blue and magnesium silver paint job it's been detailed inside and out and it's had some nice new aftermarket wheels I spent a little while trying to think of something cool to do with the paint job on this car so I hope you like it you can let me know what you think in the comments down below before I go I'll just say a big thanks to everyone for the great comments and likes on my videos extra special thanks to my awesome patreons who help to support the channel through patreon you can check out the link in the description below if you'd like to help out as well there's also a link down there where you can get 10% off Starbond super glues. Thanks heaps for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more like it, remember to subscribe and click the bell. Give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.